Today, we're diving into the incredible world of Japanese agriculture. Discover how Japanese farmers are harvesting millions of tons of expensive agricultural products using innovative techniques and advanced technology. Get ready to be amazed by the precision and efficiency behind these methods. Number 8. Smart Agriculture and Automation Japan has heavily invested in smart agriculture by utilizing robotics, IoT, Internet of Things, and AI to optimize the production and harvesting process. Many Japanese farms now employ automated machines and robots that handle labor-intensive tasks, reducing the reliance on human workers. From automated rice planters to fruit-picking robots, these systems help farmers produce more crops efficiently and with higher precision. How it works Sensors installed in fields monitor soil moisture, temperature, and plant health in real time, providing farmers with data-driven insights. Automated machines and drones plant, water, fertilize, and harvest crops based on these data points, ensuring that each plant receives the exact care it needs. For crops like fruits, robotic arms are designed to pick delicate produce without causing damage, maintaining the high-quality standards Japanese agricultural products are known for. Benefits These advanced systems significantly reduce labor costs and improve productivity. By using data analytics to predict the best times for planting and harvesting, farmers can maximize yields and minimize waste. This precision farming technique is especially beneficial for expensive crops like melons, grapes, and strawberries, which require delicate handling and attention to detail. Number 7. Vertical Farming for Premium Produce Japanese farmers have embraced vertical farming, particularly in urban areas where space is limited, to grow premium agricultural products like herbs, leafy greens, and strawberries. These farms use stack layers to grow crops indoors under controlled conditions, making it possible to produce high-quality produce year-round. How it works In vertical farms, plants are grown in a controlled environment, often using hydroponics or aeroponics, where their roots are either submerged in nutrient-rich water or exposed to mist. LED lighting replicates natural sunlight, allowing plants to grow faster. The indoor setting provides full control over temperature, humidity, and nutrient levels, ensuring that the crops grow in optimal conditions without being affected by weather or pests. Benefits Vertical farming allows Japanese farmers to grow premium produce continuously, independent of seasonal changes. It also significantly reduces the use of water and pesticides, leading to environmentally friendly production methods. Since vertical farms can be located in urban areas, they also reduce transportation costs, ensuring that fresh, high-quality produce reaches consumers quickly. This technique is especially useful for growing luxury items like premium strawberries which are sold at high prices in Japan. Number 6. Specialized Greenhouses for Controlled Growing Japan is known for its innovation in greenhouse technology which plays a critical role in producing high-quality and expensive crops such as melons, tomatoes, and ornamental flowers. These high-tech greenhouses are equipped with climate control systems that allow farmers to regulate light, temperature, and humidity to create perfect growing conditions. How it works in these advanced greenhouses, farmers use climate control systems to adjust growing conditions according to the specific needs of each crop. Automated shading systems, misting units, and temperature control mechanisms ensure that the plants are protected from extreme weather while receiving the right amount of light and moisture. For certain crops like melons, the level of sweetness is carefully controlled by adjusting the water supply, resulting in a highly prized product. Benefits Controlled environment agriculture in greenhouses allows farmers to grow crops that are otherwise challenging in outdoor conditions. This system ensures consistent quality, which is essential for maintaining the premium pricing of high-end products like melons, some of which can fetch hundreds or even thousands of dollars in the market. These specialized environments also protect against pests and diseases, minimizing the need for chemical treatments and ensuring a healthier, more organic product. Number 5. Intensive Fruit Cultivation for High-Value Varieties Japan is famous for cultivating some of the most expensive and unique fruits in the world, such as Uberi melons, Ruby Roman grapes, and Shizuoka crown musk melons. Japanese farmers use highly intensive cultivation techniques, dedicating an extraordinary level of care to each fruit to ensure its quality. How it works Farmers pay meticulous attention to the growth of each fruit, often pruning, hand-pollinating, and wrapping fruits in protective coverings to shield them from environmental damage. For melons, only a single fruit is allowed to grow per plant to ensure that all the nutrients are focused on that one fruit, enhancing its size, sweetness, and texture. In vineyards, farmers often thin out bunches of grapes to allow the remaining ones to grow larger and more flavorful. Number 4. Rice Farming with Heritage Techniques Japan's premium rice varieties such as Koshinikari and Sasanashiki are known for their taste and quality, often fetching high prices domestically and abroad. 
To produce these superior varieties, Japanese farmers combine traditional cultivation techniques with modern technology, ensuring a perfect balance between heritage and innovation. How it works Farmers carefully select the best rice varieties and grow them in carefully managed paddies. Water is essential to the rice growing process and Japan's paddy fields are meticulously controlled to maintain the ideal water levels throughout the growing season. Some farmers also incorporate ancient techniques such as growing rice in rotation with ducks, who eat pests and fertilize the crops, to enhance sustainability. During harvest, precision machines are used to thresh and clean the rice, ensuring it remains unblemished. Number 3. Grafting for superior fruit production Grafting is a time-honored technique widely used in Japan to produce premium fruit varieties like apples, cherries, and citrus. By joining together two different plants, the rootstock and the cyan, Japanese farmers create stronger, disease-resistant plants that yield superior fruits. How it works In the grafting process, the cyan, a cutting from a desired fruit variety, is attached to the rootstock, a more robust plant, to combine the strengths of both plants. The rootstock provides resilience, better water uptake, and disease resistance, while the cyan determines the quality and flavor of the fruit. This technique allows farmers to cultivate fruit that meets specific market demands such as increased sweetness or larger size, without compromising on the plant's overall health. Number 2. Water Conserving Drip Irrigation Systems With limited agricultural land and unpredictable weather, Japanese farmers rely on drip irrigation to efficiently water their crops, particularly for high-value vegetables and flowers. This system delivers water directly to the plant's roots in small, precise amounts, reducing water waste and promoting optimal plant growth. How it works Drip irrigation systems consist of a network of pipes, valves, and drip emitters that release small, controlled amounts of water directly to the base of each plant. The system is highly adjustable, allowing farmers to fine-tune the amount of water each plant receives based on its specific needs. In Japan, these systems are often combined with fertigation, where fertilizers are delivered through the same drip lines, ensuring that nutrients reach the plants efficiently. Number 1. Controlled Environment Mushrooms Farming Japan is known for producing premium quality mushrooms such as shiitake, meitake, and enoki. Farmers use controlled environment techniques to cultivate these mushrooms in specialized facilities where temperature, humidity, and light are carefully regulated to ensure high quality yields. How it works Mushrooms are grown in climate controlled rooms that mimic their natural growth environment. These rooms are equipped with systems to monitor and adjust humidity, light, air circulation, and temperature, allowing farmers to create the ideal conditions for each mushroom variety. For example, shiitake mushrooms thrive in cool, moist environments, so the facilities are kept at specific temperatures and humidity levels to encourage growth. Benefits Controlled environment mushroom farming allows for year-round production, independent of weather conditions resulting in a steady supply of premium mushrooms. By maintaining optimal growing conditions, farmers can produce mushrooms with consistent texture, flavor, and appearance, which are highly prized in both domestic and international markets. This method also reduces the risk of pests and diseases, lowering the need for chemical treatments and ensuring a healthier product. Thanks for joining us on this fascinating exploration of Japanese farming techniques. If you enjoyed learning about these innovative methods, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe for more agricultural insights. Drop your thoughts in the comments which technique impressed you the most. Until next time, keep exploring and stay curious about the wonders of agriculture.